Activists held a rally today at the Lafayette Juvenile Detention Center where an 11 year old girl is being held for allegedly murdering an Iberia Parish man. News 10's Kai Price attended the rally and gives us a look into how the organizers let their voices be heard. Community advocates for local organizations such as Village 337 and Evolve Louisiana gathered here at the Lafayette Juvenile Detention Center to show support to the 11 year old girl who was charged with second degree murder. We want justice. We want justice. We want it now. We want it now. It's been 78 days since the 11 year old girl was put behind bars for the murder of 36 year old Cameron Bedsoul of New Iberia. In response to the charges, community members marched around the detention center seven times to demand justice for what they say are wrongful charges. Angela Eaglin, vice president of Village 337, says it is brutal to have such a young child confined in jail. Why, why, why she's been incarcerated? When will she be released? Why was she arrested? Um, those details have not been made public, and we don't believe that it is of uh, Good, you know, just in good conscience to have 11 year old jailed in this country. John Milton Bishop for the African American Catholic Congregation says things need to change. To treat the children, our children, the way that it's being treated now and where our state is trying to go. Our people need to wake up all over this state, all over this country. As Dr. King said, we got some difficult days ahead. Yes. Laramie Griffin, founder of Evolve Louisiana calls for law enforcement with empathy and urgency to release the 11 year old girl. Do what's right within your heart. Do what's right by your children if this is your child. Yeah. And that's what we're asking. We're asking for truth, we're asking for transparency, and we're asking for this 11 year old girl to be released. The next trial date for the 11 year old girl is scheduled for March 7 in the Iberia Parish Courthouse. In Lafayette, Kai Price, KLFY, News 10. Village 337 and Evolve Louisiana say they will be in attendance for the next trial date. Meanwhile, the girls' attorneys tell News 10 they believe she is innocent.